Hello, this is Haku Dabin, and I am here with something that can quickly become political. And as I've seen in the past, has become political before. I think that my views are going to be pretty obvious. You'll see it, it, it pretty quickly here. Whatever the case, this is called Clever Comebacks. A separate where people have a very um, high IQ comebacks to really dumb things people say on the internet. Like pretty much everything I say on the internet. I'm quite sure you all have plenty of clever comebacks to any and all things I say in these videos. You should probably put them in the comments so I can actually see them. Anyway, let's get right into it. Dallas police refused to open in a case for a child who went missing after using the restroom at a Mavericks game. Signing Texas code dictating missing juveniles are investigated as runaways, unless there are circumstances which appear, and that's the end of the post. If your daughter is kidnapped in Texas, tell the police you're reporting her for seeking an abortion. Perhaps they will take it seriously if they think the life of, the, of an embryo is in danger. Just remember, pro-life is actually anti-life. It's just anti-choice. That's the real old name of it. <laughs> Will you please stop with the nickname Tiny? We get it. You like or or wieners, but you don't need to openly judge men by their or, or PP size. Also applies to his IQ, integrity, hands, etc. Yeah, this is about the previous president. Very accurate. Oh, here we have uh, an idiot. Pants were invented for men, not women. It's impossible for a woman to wear pants. Jeeds, yoga pants, dress pants, leggings, dungarees, etc. without sexualizing her body, since they highlight her legs, curves, and rear end. Women who want to be mosh do not own pants at all. You know, there are plenty of other people who would look okay, okay. hello sexy in pants, not just women. But go off. That's a lot of words for nobody will bang me. <laughs> Someone with alpha male in their name says, God doesn't make mistakes. He made you. Call me old fashioned, but if I were a parent, I'd quite like to know what or my son, Sam, was showing up at school as Samantha. If you don't already know, there's a reason she's not telling you. It's you. You're the problem. So remember, transphobes are the problem. I pray to him, and he guides me. So those yes is my really specific prayers quickly, like the time I prayed for a fine tipped sharpie and I got one within 30 minutes, despite being in a mountainous remote area in a foreign country. And I know him through the Bible. God ignores the Holocaust. Finds you a sharpie. Sounds legit. The spread of coronavirus is based on two factors. Oh yeah, coronavirus is that virus that happened in 2020, everyone knows what it is. 
I'm not centering myself. I'm going to see how quickly I get banned for that one. Who cares? One, how dense the population is, as in how packed together everyone is. And two, how dense the population is. This time, dense means... Well... Anti-maskers. Think of those people. Anyway. Roll the same thing twice. What's the other one? You're number two. <laughs> He's... They poop. <coughs> Why the heck am I saying commercials in Spanish on regular channels on TV in the USA? With way too many explanation points. Because this is the USA, where the total number of languages spoken is 311. That's 310 more, more languages than you are able to speak. As a matter of fact, 60% of the world speaks more than one language. That means you and 40% of people need to catch up, not the other way around. Hope you can understand. We hope this, this helps. I can't read that. Unfortunately, I am only fluent in two languages. And one of them is not unverbal. How fun. A friend told me that hours after the, having the AZ edit trap, he was sitting at a dining table when he suddenly projectile vomited pints of black blood over the next four days. He suffered bleeding from his rectum, had blood in his semen, and came up and bruises all over his body. And despite all of this, he was still able to rub one out. If you're projectile vomiting and bleeding from your rectum for four days straight, I don't think you're gonna... you know... just crazy thought. Eric Trump. <laughs> I have to tell you, I was on a plane when this whole indictment and broke. People were coming up to me, giving me hugs. Not likely true. Even on his family train. Yeah, nobody really, really likes the Trump family. There's a reason. Ooh, we have to go to a different tab for this one. Let's go. Astrid Kutcher and Mia Kunis revealed they will donate their $275 million of fortune to charity and not leave anything for their children. They say they don't want their children to become spoiled and entitled, and want them to be motivated to work hard. Why would you do that to them? I'm gonna be real, not leaving your kids a fortune kind of screws them out of ever owning a house. At least, in America. I don't know about any other country, so. Stay on the right path, even if you, if you have to walk alone. That's the left path. <laughs> Couldn't do a, an image flip there. Grown men really let a football match ruin their day. Grown women let zodiac signs shape their future. I think both are very immature. I actually don't like either. <sighs> well, that's because uh, I actually have uh, fun things to watch during my time.
Hey, uh, I am Jericho. Heard some um, juice for your championship belt? We got plenty of cardboard. Want a new one? Hey, Arby's. I'm all good. Save the cardboard to make your sandwiches. Ivanka a Trump on more. There is a special place in heck for people who prey on children. Ivanka Trump, your earth father admitted to intentionally walking in on teenage girls getting dressed. <laughs> Didn't you graduate from... I'm just gonna say sex worker university. The spelling is kind and a smelly. Yep, and it's Ivy League compared to Trump University. That's pretty true. Ah oh, yes, ceiling fans are none to be sharp enough to cut hair. Ah, uh, yes. Writers are known to be sharp enough to identify a joke. They aren't. I'm gonna just skip this one. I don't know this person, but they... Actually, I don't know. I don't know what senior level contact acts at the UK at Delhi Embassy. Our visa has been processed for 8 plus weeks now, and our flight is scheduled next week. Please DM me. Thanks a lot. The Art of Cold Emailing. A thread. I don't get it. This one, actually, I'm a bit lost on. I think I'm going to open this in a new tab, just to see what the number two is, if there is one. Hey, wait, where is number two? Might be the dumbest person in life. Well, you saw me get tricked. That's fine. My kids will not be stuck up to an iPad. They'll be outside playing. Imaginary children are the easiest to raise. Honestly, just don't have children. The electric light bulb will destroy the American whale oil lamp industry as we know it. Oh wait, no, that's the reply. I might be a little bit it's small brain. The Green in New Deal will destroy the American ener energy industry as we know it. The electric light bulb will destroy the American and whale oil lamp industry as we know it. Hmm. <laughs> Did we win World War Two? Look at the Prime Minister of the UK, the Mayor of London, and the First Minister of Scotland. No, mate. Nazis lost. Sorry. Making a plant illegal is like saying God was wrong. Making a plant illegal was one of the first things God ever did. Ironically true.
Oh, this is gonna be fun to make fun of. A healthy nine-year-old Florida girl was paralyzed by the flu shot. It wasn't the flu shot. It was being in Florida. <laughs> the benefit of vaccines far exceed any of the very minuscule rare complications or risks. Lol, well, I've done plenty of research on both sides. I've made up my decision and I didn't come to Facebook to discuss it with people. I didn't post this for a debate. Alright, fair. Let's change the subject then. Do you like, like DIY stuff like Pinterest? Yeah, but I never get to finish any projects. I have projects sitting around my house that I need to finish. What do I hear is a project for you to start working on while you spread anti-vaccine propaganda? Child's casket. Very accurate. Vaccinate your kids. Vaccinate your crotch goblins. You decide to keep the parasite, you better vaccinate it. Anyway. <sighs> old people being old. Let's continue. President Trump won't touch you with a 10-foot pole. True, he used a 3-inch one. Oh, okay. These jokes are getting a little bit samey. Um... Oh, uh, okay, yeah. I, dear Amy, I am an average attractive single woman who lives in a big city. I am frequently approached by men of other races that flirt with me and try to get my phone number. How do I tell them I'm not interested without offending them? I stick to my own kind. No thanks. It is fairly easy to... say no thank you. But if you truly want to repel these interested men, you could tell them, No offense, but I'm a racist. They should leave you alone after that. Imagine just coming out as a racist to the whole entire internet. It's so hard to see sometimes. I know, can you see that? Um, finally, Lord Ram is asking in the for reg registration for PM modding. I don't know what that means. Padmashri loading. Get back my pen. Please spare it. Please don't sell it. I, I literally don't get it. It's that fun time of year where uh, it's hot coffee weather in the morning and cold coffee weather by the afternoon. It's that fun time of year to stop union busing and negotiate a fair contract with your workers. It's that fun time of year, which is all the time. Workers' rights.
Oh boy, Josh Howley. Tonight's indictment of Donald Trump isn't about the law. It's about power. Raw power. It's a Democrat and party telling the nation they will stop at nothing to control the outcome of the next presidential election. It is an assault on our democracy, pure and simple. Ironic from the side of politics that literally on January 6th of 2021 stormed the Capitol in an attack against democracy and is known for right now making in plenty of state laws to attack and try and end democracy by making it so that only old people can vote because they don't want younger, the younger generation to have a say anymore because they want to you already know what they want to do Anyway, the first indictment of Donald Trump, there will be many more, is not an outrage, an attack of the, on the rule of law, an assault of our democracy, an attempt by Democrats to interfere in the next presidential election. It's about a criminal finally being held accountable. The worst part about it is that it took so long. Oh, jeez, I cannot. Oh, the irony. We're going to see something very ironic here. The weaponization of the legal system to advance the political agenda turns the rule of law on its head. It's un-American. The Soros backs Manhattan District Attorney has consistently bent the law to downgrade felonies to and to excuse criminal misconduct. Yet now he's stretching the law to target a political opponent. Florida will not assist in an extradition request given the questionable circumstances at issue with this Soros backs Manhattan prosecutor and his political agenda. Huh. Pretty interesting from the person who is literally changing law constantly to attack children. Not just any children. Children of a minority group. Trans children. Gay children. Children who are not cishet and white. But let's continue. <sighs> you morons do realize there's not going to be such a request, and if there were one, the Constitution requires the Santas to honor it, or he's broken the law. Right? I don't know. I don't know much about the law. All I know is... Is that the Santas has been literally making legislation to attack trans children. A lot of states have, actually. Eric Trump. I am so tired of hearing in that last name. I kind of thought it was over. Whatever. I went into the literary CVS yesterday and you can't find Tylenol because it's locked behind these glass counters. But yet yeah, their attention is going after Donald Trump. You can still buy it. It's not high in the old museum. Uh, probably the most wholesome post we've got. Depluralize a film. I'll start. Jaw. A crow on the Orient Express. Nothing is worse than a Yankee telling a Southerner that his monuments don't matter. Slavery. Slavery was worse. Literally. I get that pe that um, people from the South do not like to study history whatsoever, but they do know why they were beaten in the Civil War, right?
Today, America became a communist country, officially. Did I completely miss the means of production being seized yesterday? Dang, I was supposed to join in on that. Ah. Eh, nah. <laughs> bad jokes by Jeff. I love bad jokes by Jeff because they're such good jokes. I was applying for Australian citizenship and the interviewer asked, Do you have a criminal record? And I said, No, is that still required? <laughs> oh boy, it's her, Caitlyn Jenner. The most transphobic trans woman I... One of the most transphobic trans women I know of. Anyway. We live in a beautiful country called America, where we are free to be whomever we want. The radical rainbow mafia ha has hijacked LGBTQIA+. Don't forget that part, please. Intersex and ace people exist. People and it's the worst thing that has ever happened to LGBTQIA plus people. They are domestic terrorists. The only terrorist is you behind the wheel of a car. Hmm. <sighs> All right, this is fun. If vaccines were healthy, you could put it on a spoon and eat it. Try it. You'll die. If broccoli was healthy, you could put it in a syringe and inject it into your bloodstream. Try it. You'll die. Winston, if you were my husband, I'd put poison in your coffee. Nancy, if you were my wife, I'd drink it. Ah, no, Winston Churchill a little sounded. I kind of just went with Hank Hill there. <laughs> okay, this is this is a good one. This site is ran by hypocrites. Hippocrates died around the 370 BCE. Alright, I think that's enough for today. Oh boy, did that get political. Video where I get Ed cancelled for being trans? Let's go. If you liked the video, please leave a like on the the video comment down below and subscribe to the channel if you didn't like the video please comment to me about how much of a republican you are i'm sure i definitely give a crap i don't see you tomorrow goodbye